Hey there, I am still here and I've missed making videos. Um, hey, when I just disappear, somebody poked me, asked me, Oz, what the hell is going on? Where are you? Crap data is taking over and you done left us high and dry. We're in this bunker with our rifles. We're running out of food. Oz, show up. Over the past few months, I have been heads down at a cigar lounge writing the third edition of Guerrilla Data Analysis. Sometimes I was there for nine hours writing and this book is called Guerrilla Data Analysis, third edition, Conquering Crap Data and Excel Skirmishes. I'm really excited about this because we are doing more than Excel tips and tricks. Yes, there will be pivot tables. We're updating it to include Power Query and Unpivot. We've got the Met function. I wrote about that last week. All kinds of really good stuff. But the Excel skirmishes is like telling real world stories about, you know, the things that matter, but they aren't directly Excel tips and tricks. After three months at that cigar lounge, this past Sunday night, I turned the book over to Bill so that he can write his sections. And then it'll go and start the three editing phases sometime early in February. And we expect the book to be out around June. That's, that's what we're targeting, all right? Now that the book is turned over to Bill, now I can start making videos again. This time, I'm gonna show you something short and sweet. The first real VDA challenge that I had. I see a way of doing it without VDA. I have all of this mall data. And what I need out of column B is the bold font. That's what I, I don't need all that other stuff. I need West Hills experience, Fashion Alley Shops, the mall at Silver Lakes, Starlight Mall of Port St. Jean. All those years ago, some kind soul online wrote me some code to strip out the bold font. You can't do this in native Excel. You can't do it in Power Query either. Power Query gets rid of all formatting. How am I gonna strip this stuff out? Like this. I am gonna copy this. Copy. And then go into Word. Right click. Paste this stuff in here. All right, beautiful. Replace. More. Format. Font. Regular. Okay. Replace it with nothing. Replace all. Okay. Got it. There it all is. No VBA code. Go back. Highlight this stuff. Copy. Put this stuff back to Excel. Boom. And then here's one of my tricks that I like. With that already highlighted, I'm gonna hold down the shift key, grab this here, go over here, wait for that skinny line. Look at that, whoo, look at that. There we go. That is what we wanted. 